Yo guys, what's up? How we doing? I apologise about the late start. I'm just uh, getting a few bits ready here. Let's go to... Just sorting out this laptop and things like that for you guys. See if we can get a few tags in. So this is my profile as you can see. Welcome to the stream, whoever that is. I'll be with you shortly. We're just uh, going to add a few tags and things like that to the stream. Uh, view and watch page. Here we go. Just make sure the audio is okay. Yep, awesome. Audio's there. I've just got to alter the description. No, I don't think I will. Uh, the description's pretty cool, so we'll leave it there. Okay, so I've got it on my profile page for you guys just to have a look at while I sort this laptop out, guys. So I do apologise about that. Let me just... Um, here we go. Right. Just add that. So if you could just bear with me for two minutes, guys, I'd really appreciate that. I hope everybody's having a great day today. Uh, advanced settings. I just want to put the game in. So everyone knows what we're playing. Here we go. Save settings. And basic information. Some tags. Your are fishing. Any questions about the profile, guys? Just whack it in the comments. I'll catch up with the comments in two seconds. I've just got to put some tags in, and then we're ready to go. Uh, don't want to go too mad with the tags. Live stream. That though. problem is when you're streaming from the PS4 the only thing you can do is once you've started the stream you can then add your tags excuse me right here we go okay let's get the show on the road Scott322 oh here we go yo how you doing my friend Martin Conemans welcome my friend Callum Ralph yo Danny Robinson yo how we doing guys? Dylan Lee, yo. I hope we're all keeping well. Love the videos, Big Bug. Thank you very much. Love your videos, mate. Great stuff. Oh, you guys are awesome. Right, guys. Put it in the comments where you want me to fish. So, let's have a look what lakes we got. Uh, single player. Freedom fishing. Right, there's the lakes, guys. The observatory. Lorena. Digger Lake, St. John's Lake, or Preza del Monte Bravo. Stick it in the comments, guys. I'd really appreciate that, where you'd like to see me. Bravo, Digger. Well, it's Bravo or Digger Lakes at the moment, guys. Don't forget to smash that like for me, guys. That is really important. Okay. I'll tell you what I'll do then. I'll start on... Oh. Would like to have a little fish off one weekend, mate, if you're up for it. Yeah, I'll be up for it, Danny. No problem. I'm definitely up for that. I think you're on a cat at St. John's. Yeah, I, I don't want to bore you guys with St. John's. I, I really want to go to St. John's. I'll be honest with you. Look, I'm even set up for the big cats on St. John's. Look, I've changed my line to £25 Supernatural. I've put the sinking and pop-up tiger nuts on with an 18mm dumbbell and a 15mm uh, activate boilie. Size 4 and 6 hooks. I'm ready for big fish, so... I smash the light for you, mate. Thank you very much. Martin, Digger Lakes, go to the most right swim. 15mm activate, 18mm dumbbell and high-vis pop-ups. Did the trick for me. Hello, Big Bug. Love the videos. Charlie and Ben are watching you. Thank you very much, Charlie and Ben. Much appreciated. You guys are awesome. Uh, if anyone don't remember, I did uh, give 
Charlie and Ben. I'll give Ben a big shout out a few weeks ago. Right, guys, I'll tell you what. Why don't we start on... Uh, Digger, so you can get the rest of those boss fish. Right, I'm going to do... I'm going to start on Digger Lakes. We'll see how we get on. If we don't get on very well, then I'll move to Presa del Monte Bravo. I really want to go to St. John, but I want it to be a little bit different for you guys. Right, so I'm going to change it to 5 o'clock in the morning. It's a long day, random. I'm going to put the conditions on light clouds again. I've got some real exciting news coming up for you guys soon as well regarding a giveaway. But you'll have to uh, you'll have to bear with me with that. It will be a giveaway to do with this game. So who knows, maybe I might have a couple of codes to give away for the game. Or a few t-shirts or something like that. But you'll have to bear with me on that one guys, but it's coming. Right, so we're going to Digger Lakes. I should have looked at what boss fish I need. I need three boss fish on this lake, I believe. One, two, I think there's seven on here and I've caught four of them. <coughs> I've had the halfling twice. I've had boxer. I've had pack M. Right, we're going to the far right, definitely. Who else have I had? I've had some, some others on here as well. Would you be going online? How do you mean, Max? I will, when they patch this, which is going to be soon, I will do um, sort of lobbies for you guys to come in and join. Right. This is the corner I've picked. Now... The problem is, the rigs I've actually got on, there's only one that will probably suit this. Now, I'm not going to fish that first swim, which is there. That will give us that. I'm going to fish this second swim just here. And that gives me this whole sort of scope to this corner. That's where we're going. Right, we set our sticks out, or our wands, as, we're, as they're known. Right, so, I'm not messing around, guys. I'm after big fish. Right, so let's go... Right, I'm going to use a Calder KD rig size 4 with a floating 20mm Tiger. Uh, you can use pop-ups on that, so no worries there. Right, rod 2. Uh, let's put this rod down. Here we go. Right, rod 2. I'm going to use an 18mm dumbbell pop-up on a chud rig. And rod 3. I'm going to use, let's have a look, that's on a 20mm Tiger, I don't want to use that at the moment. Uh, da, 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 da. Let's use an Activate Boily on a size 6 KD rig. That's where we're at guys. So we're just going to, um, I might be better off using that Activate on rod one or two well, let's have a look let's have a little cast over there i can't remember what the bottom's like over on there let's have a little go let's have a look oh you go right so we've got silt silt right weed silt right okay let's leave that there let's go to the second rod it's a pop-up dumbbell on the chod rig i'm going to put this smack bang in the middle of the lilies that's the the plan that's the plan We'll see what happens. Right, so silt. Let's leave it in the lilies. Let's see what actually happens in them lilies. And this one I'm going to put just to the left there. I just saw a tail pop up there as well. So let's do that. Going to overcast it and then wind back onto the spot that I want. I hope everyone's having an awesome day today. Wow, the one in the weed's gone straight away. Look at that. Okay, that is awesome. Feels good straight away. Feels like it could be a good start actually. We'll see how we get on. First fish of the day I'm always nervous about because I don't want to lose the first fish. It's like a tradition thing. Go in France in July 8th with my dad. Oh wow, that is awesome. Yeah, I need to get myself in France, do some nice carp fishing out there. 
That's exactly what I want to do. I will catch up with your comments, guys. Just bear with me. It's fighting hard. I'm going to say this is going to be about £18, this one. Oh, oh, oh. The other two rods are gone as well. Oh, my days. Right. I was hoping to be able to take my time with this one. But looking like we might have to rush a little bit here. Rod 1's kind of disappearing to the left. Rod 3's just there, so... See what happens. Come on. No. No. Yes, right. He's in catch mode. Straight onto rod one. He's disappearing around the corner. The thing I do love about this lake is you know it, it's all carp in here. But like I said, we'll start on this lake. We'll see how we get on. Then maybe if we have a boss fish off here, we'll move on to Preza del Monte Bravo. See if we can maybe get a couple of them big cats or... A, if you guys fancy it, we'll go to St. John or somewhere like that. Come on, in you come. I might put this one right in them reeds there, you know. Uh, in the lilies, sorry. I do like a lake with lilies, I've got to be honest. Woo, a live stream, says Ben Weber. You know, my friend. You know, look at that. Look, Rod Free's kind of on the bank. He's gone for a picnic. We're probably going to lose that one. £20 says Scott322. I think you could be right. I think we're going to lose this one though. Yeah. See if we can give him some stick and get him back in the lake. That would be nice. Come on. Oh, he might come. Come on. Get your butt back in the water. You're going to drown on the bank, aren't you? Come on. Get in that water. I've got a free Burger King for ya. Yes, here we go. Right. No. Get out. No. Get back in the water. I'm trying to give him some stick, guys, actually. God. I want to see what this fish is now. Wow. Yes, he's back in the water. I don't think he's very big, actually. That's awesome. We managed to get him off the bank. Just taking it easy. This has been a rough fight, this one. You see his tail flicking out the water there. Come on. I'm having no mate chip butty whilst watching this mate. That is awesome, my friend. Right, let's put him in the net. Three, so, three, first three rods out. Three fish. Can't be grumbling at that. Nice common. £21.5. He decided to go for a Donald's or whatever, but we managed to get him back. Very nice. Really pleased with that. Okay, let's get the next one in. Nice. Right. Could you ask someone to sub to my channel? Thanks, Big Bug. Riley Pitcher, is that? £16, 8 ounces. There you go, my friend. Awesome. And next one. Come on, how about saying really nice? Ah, oh, look at that. Lovely mirror. Nice dark head. Big tail. And sort of flecks of red in the tails. And only £16.15 ounces, but very nice. Excuse me. Okay. Let's get this one back out. i and put this one between the lilies, I think. What I do... Oh, went a bit bit mad there. I think we'll leave it about there. Um, what I think I might do is change that to a chod and put it right in the middle of this sort of lily bed that's on my sort of right shoulder there. We'll see how we get on. Let's get this one out. Into them lily beds. Now, it's not the biggest lily bed that we... Oh, perfect. It's only a couple of feet deep there as well, so... We'll see how we get on with that. And this one we'll put just down here again. Just cast that out. Like I said to you guys, um, I'm hoping to be able to do a giveaway very soon. You have to bear with me. Um, but I'm, ho I'm working on it, guys, okay? So, I'm hoping maybe... I've might be able to get some game codes or some t-shirts or something. I'm not sure yet. 
But that's what I'm hoping. But obviously the rule will be you'll have to be subscribed. That will go without saying. And keep your notifications on your subscription, guys. Because if I can't see you, then when the freebies do come, or the freebies or the giveaways, you won't be able to enter. Right, here we go. Yeah. That one right in them lilies is working well. I'm going to change that number one rod to a chod rig. Uh, and put it smack bang in them lilies to the sort of left of me, I think. Anyone heard of about an update and also a new lake? New lake should be coming in November. That's the rumour I've heard. The update apparently was in June or July. So, I know Dovetail are working hard on it. Um... They do know of the issues, so we've just got to give them a bit of time. You know, it's quite a... Although the game's not big regarding how many gig it is, um, obviously, they've got to go around, check all the lakes, check why we're sort of getting kicked out of multiplayer. They are working hard on it, guys. I can say that for sure. But, I mean, it. the way I look here is this. Um, it is frustrating. Oh, I thought I had another fish on then. I don't know why I'm in that mode. The way I look at it is when you're fishing, you don't land every single fish that you hook. You just don't. So what I've done is I took the approach of, um, you know, some fish you lose. And that's the way I look at it. Unfortunately, it does seem to be the big cats. Oh, here we go. That I seem to lose more than anything. Come on. Ah, oh, the other rod's off as well. Now, could we be seeing some boss fish soon? Uh, I've got Carp Sim on iPhone. It's due to come out on PS4. Yeah, I've used to play that Carp Simulator on going back ages ago when they, it hadn't been out long. <clears throat> a good little game to be fair they've probably worked on it quite a lot now it was a good little game the game that I'm keeping an eye on at the moment as well not fishing related but um, one that I know is coming or going on the Xbox One is uh, that player unknown battlegrounds that looks amazing, and I'm hoping they bring it to the PS4. But um, I'm also hoping to have a, a decent gaming PC, kind of with, realistically within the next year. Um, but we'll see what happens there. If I can get a decent gaming PC, I can bring such better content to you guys. That's what it's all about. Um, I'm sorry if I missed any comments, guys. I did see some comments. Let me have a look. Killing which game in? Hi, Big Bug. I'm your. Let me just get this fish. Hang on. Hi, Big Bug. I'm your. Hi, Big Bug. I'm your favourite YouTuber. And if you have PC, you should try Carp Fish Sim on Steam. It's so good, mate. Like I said, I did play it on Big Chaz. Anyone heard about updates? Also, no lake yet. Yeah, answered that. That's awesome. I do apologise if I'm missing any comments, guys. I watched your last live stream, done well. All your fish, keep up the good work, mate. Thank you so much, Riley, much appreciated. Okay, come on in, you come. Let's be having ya. Yeah, that carp sim was a good game, i got to say. But, console-wise, and general fishing, this game has hit it right on the head for me this game is awesome 11 pound hmm, not massive gotta be honest right so what i'm thinking now then is i'm going to change this to a size 6 chod rig on that tiger nut and i'm going to put it right in them lilies that's the plan smack bang in the middle right awesome then rod two I'm gonna put in them lilies just 
just heard something big splash to the left of us, definitely. Oh, didn't even reach it. Oh, my base. Come on, big bug, what are you doing? Right, let's get it over there. Don't forget to smash that like, guys. I'd really appreciate that. That would mean a lot to me. Right, number three. When you hit the like, it helps the video come up in the YouTube ratings. So it gets more views. And in turn, we'll get more likes and etc, etc. It helps the video grow, helps the channel grow. Awesome. Right, so that's on the silk bed. Any boss fish yet, mate? No, we've not long started, Scott, as you know. Marching says, on the right, there is a small opening. Throw the chod in there and you might get bruiser. Small opening. Ah, what, just there? That small opening just there, sort of on my right shoulder now, yeah, just sort of there. I think I've had bruise, I'm not sure. I've had four of the seven boss fish, so I've got three to find. Um, yes, in the middle. Ah, oh, right, okay, we'll give that a go. I think we might change all to chod rigs, to be fair, the way it's going. Chod rigs and tiger nuts. Woohoo! Come on. In you come. It's fighting well. It's got that typical plod of a car, but it just plods around. <laughs> Dan, I added you on PS4. Noddy Taylor 72. Hi, big bugs. I just got a boss fish. Indie, mate. Nice. That's a nice tench, that is, Indie. That is a tench, isn't it? Indie? Yeah, I think it is. Very nice. That is awesome. It's nice to hear you guys catching the boss fish and smashing the game as well. That is really cool. Sweet. Might do stream soon. Whoa, here we go. £14.7. Very nice. Oh, number three's off. We're gonna, we are going to change number three into the chod. And we're going to put it in that little gap that uh, Martin... Martin Martin just said Martin. Oh, nice tail showing now. It's got a bit of power, this fish. Oh, don't go that way. Come on. No. I'm trying to hold it. It's pulling hard, this fish. No. Come back this way. <laughs> this way, we don't mind. Let's give him a little bit of pressure. I'm trying to hold him just around them lilies. We don't want to lose any fish if we can help it. This fish is fighting hard. Yes, turned him. Come on. Just putting as much pressure on the rod as I could just to try and turn him away from that bank. This fish is fighting very hard. Could it be? Could it be? Easy, easy, easy. Just turn him at the last second. Oh, yes, right. Watch under the tip. That's where the most pressure's at. Come on, in you come, in you come, in you come. No. Yes. Let's net him. Couldn't see him going through the water then. Usually you get a look. Come on. Be a boss fish. Ah, oh, is that half lean? I've had half lean a few times before. Let's have a look. Yes, the half lean. There you go. First boss fish of the session. That was a lot quicker than I thought it would be, guys. I'm not going to lie to you. Big Bug, what is your best pond to catch boss? As I haven't caught one yet, and I would love to. Do you use silt rigs? Yes, I do use silt rigs, my friend. Uh, best pond for me has been St. John, if I'm honest. There you go, guys. Half lean. First boss fish of the session. Absolutely over the moon with that. So if I now move this, if I change this to a chod. Let's use a dumbbell. I think that's what uh, Martin. Martin, is it? Martin, he said. He said there's a little gap. I think that's the gap there that he means on the right. So if I stick it in there. 
then you can correct me if I'm right or wrong, my friend. Let me know. Oh, a little bit hard cast. There. What, just there? Thank you, big bug. No problem, my friend. Riley, I've got loads of videos on setups and things that I use for St. John that's helped me catch boss fish. You should take a look, my friend. Yes, that's it. Awesome. Right, let's put the rod down. Fingers crossed, my friend, that we have a... Uh, just tighten this. Let's get this one back in the lilies. I don't want to overcast it too far, because you guys will just laugh. Awesome. Right, and number one. Let's put number one... Just to the left of them lilies. But I want it in the weed. I don't want it. Like there. That's where I want it. It's sort of in between the two lily beds. But still in the weed. That one's smack bang in the middle. And that one's just over the back there. That is awesome. We'll have to be careful though. I got Megalodon again. Oh wow, small bug 33. That is awesome. I like hearing that, my friend. I don't. I take it you're not on PS4, um, because I've not actually heard of anyone catching Megalodon on PS4. Is that? Is would that would I be right in saying that? You're all going to tell me you've caught Megalodon now, aren't you? And I'm the only one that hasn't. <laughs> Yo, this feels good. Not a boss, but definitely feels nice. You can tell by sort of your real tension. If your real tension's quite high, like I've got it there, 39's quite high. Um, not a boss. But if it's like 32 and it's still taking line off you and your, your line's at sort of maximum stretch. Come on, come this way. Don't make me look a fool now. Come on. Yeah, here we go. Nice. All three rods are going absolutely bananas. I really want that that third rod because that is uh, cruising along that margin now. Oh, it's coming back into the middle of the lake. That's cool. Let's uh, get straight onto rod three. Feels good. It feels like quite good fish. Tension's up quite high though. So, not a boss, but you can give him a little bit of stick. Can you imagine the state of this swim once I'd finished it in real life? The lilies would be everywhere. The reeds would be smashed up. Come on, come on, come on. Get in. Right, get that rod up. Get that rod up, bye. Here we go. There we go. Right. Come on. Get in. Ah, oh, right. Rod one. That's in uh, sort of fish mode, if you like. Catch mode. I call it. Let's call it in the net. They're in the net. Let's see what this one's going to do. Doesn't feel massive. Uh, you small bug, mate. Awesome. Well done, James. Welcome to the stream, my friend. Ash Clark, great vid, trying to use imitation maggots for the cats. Apparently that's quite a good method, I understand, Ash. Um, people have said to me before, use the imitation maggots. And apparently it's worked. Popped up, I believe, I think they said. Someone said use a pop-up rig for them. Come on. Free fish on the bank, maybe. That would be nice. Oh, easy. Come on, in you come. Smashing the place up at eight yard, the eight yard dash. As we've sort of come to well know, know it, known it, know it. I'm struggling to get my words out tonight, what the hell. How was that chip butty, by the way? Right, I had bad die. Dire, dire. What's the most, what's your most favourite lake pond to fish? Probably St. John. I've spent a long time on St. John, if I'm honest. 
Um, and I'm only after, I think it's about six boss fish now, or six or seven maybe. So I'd like to get that, that sort of lake finished off. Another little mirror. Get that one straight back. Let's have a look at rod three. And... A little common, I reckon. What do we reckon? Common, mirror... A common. There you go. Nice little common. £12.11 ounces. Let's get them back out. Right, let's get these rods back on the spot. Right, I've got to try and make that cast again. This should be fun. Might need a little more or less. No, right. A bit more. It's got to be right, guys. I don't mind casting onto the other bank and then kind of winding onto it. Like this. There we go. Right, so I see 0.8 feet of water. A little bit more water than that. That'll do. Number two. Let's put this one into them lilies, or just the other side would be ideal, actually. Okay, that'll do. Thank you very much. And number one, let's bang this straight in the middle. Straight in the middle of these two lilies. It's like a two separate lily pads there, sort of patches of lilies there. I want to try get in between them like there. Nice. So I get the spot out. No, I'm not going to spot at the moment. There's plenty of fish down here. And if you notice, the wind's coming down into this bay as well. So that makes it all the better. <clears throat> but your equipment from the bottom left section. What? Hi, James. Just keep playing and you'll catch them. You're probably going to catch more when you don't know what you are doing. That is so true. That is so true. Unanimous decision is absolutely bang on now. Buy your equipment, bottom left section. Yep. Got to buy equipment. That's part, all part of it. Oh, he's heading for that bank, guys. Come on. Just concentrate a second while we get this out of this corner. Nice, he's coming in. Trying to read your comments at the same time. Anyone notice on St. John's? Oi, oi, oi. No, don't go that way. All right, thank you. Okay, we'd like to get you in the net now, please, because we have another run. Anyone notice that on St. John's, four or five hours ago, in fish sharp at your feet? That is so true. Uh, Martin, Martin, I think your name is. Sorry, I'm going to say Martin, Martin. Um, that is very true. They, it's been reported that they start showing up at your feet. I think that's the game's way of kind of helping you out a little bit. Um, they, the, what are you doing over there? Get off the bank. I think the game developers are probably sort of... They know people have played this for long periods of time. I definitely have. And they know that sometimes people just need a bit of help. So they kind of bring the fish right in close. It kind of happened to us yesterday, if you remember rightly, in the stream. Um, we caught a uh, big snotty. And then I started seeing fish showing up at my feet. So I fished real close and then we caught Humpy, the carp. Or Humpty, whatever his name is. So it does work. It definitely does work. You're so right. Nice. Right, rod one. Okay, so we've got two in the net. Let's try and get this one in. Come on. You got this. He's on a cruise. Is he actually taking line off me? This fish are actually taking line. Let's give him a bit more pressure. A little bit more pressure. He's still taking line. It's encouraging. Now we give him a bit of stick. Oh, not too much. He doesn't. He's trying to get round that corner. I can't quite see round that corner. 
There we go. Right, it's back out in front of us. All right, come on. Don't forget to uh, smash that like for me, guys. If you're new around here, hit that subscribe. That would be really cool. If you like your fishing, you're definitely in the right place. Yes, got him. Right, awesome. Let's have a read of some of these comments. Boom, another boss fish. Norak, £62, same tactics. Nice one, Dovetail Fisher. That is cool. I've had Norax myself. A real nice fish. I think that's my actual personal best carp, actually, on this game, Norax. £18.9. Let's have a look on the other rods. They're in the net already. Let's get him in. Wow. That is not a monster. £8.12. And the next one, please. Get him in the net. Get in. Yes. Right. Awesome. Nice common. £14.11 ounces. Can't grumble at that, guys. Liked Big Bug. Thank you so much. Airsoft Weapons. Yo, welcome to the stream, my friend. Thank you very much. Wade Jones. Yo. How you doing? Small Bug. Danny, I have red face. Yep. Uh, hi, Bug. Hashtag great catching. Thank you very much, Ben. Much appreciated. Two seconds. I'll read the rest of your comments out. Let's move slightly to the left on that one. Just sort of... But well, you'll see if I can get it there. Here we go. That's what, exactly where I was thinking. Kind of like there. Let's get these rods out. I caught cut sixty-five pound. Very nice, nice fish. I've not had cuts yet. Um, I would like to catch it. I I probably will go to Monte Bravo on this uh, live stream as well. We'll see how we go for time, guys. And number one, fish jumping around in front of me. I'm gonna literally plunk this in front of me. Let's get this one right. I'm kind of thinking there. That's what I was thinking. I don't usually fan my rods out like this, guys. So that's two live streams you've seen that now. Okay. Good luck for moving. Sid is back. Thank you very much, James Dog T. I'm catching a lot of carp on this game. Has only got it yesterday. Yeah, it is an awesome game, my friend. Big Bug, I'm on a boss fish bringing it. In. I'm stalking on Monty Bravo. Small bug 33. Nice, my friend. Marching says, I got a vid from St. John's catching brown cat. Almost on the bank. Nice one, my friend. I've had brown cat a few times, actually. I like where Rod 3 is. Yeah, I quite like where that one is. I've got to be honest. Looks quite, quite, um, I don't know. I'm expecting it, you know. Please play Hunting Sim if you get a chance to play it. Nobody loves me. Um, yeah, I did look at that game. I've got to be honest. I wasn't sure what people would think about it. Dovetail Fishing Bravo, but I might well do. BB, do you vlog real fishing too? I, Frank, I am going to. Um, I've not had a chance to go fishing for a while. I have got a, a load of... Uh, video of my last fishing session i didn't actually catch anything um i fish a real hard syndicate water um if you had to put it on level of hardness it would be very hard so but i could put that up i suppose i could edit it and but i definitely will oh see that just slightly moved the rod and it went off um I would like to do vlogs for you guys, I've got to be honest on the fishing, but I get there and I get set up and then I think to myself, oh, I'll do a bit of video and then I kind of forget, I end up talking to someone over a cup of coffee and then before you know it, the night's drawn in and you're sort of crashing out, this is a good fish this fish, fighting hard. I caught 54 cat on Monty Bravo, very nice my friend, very nice. Number three is trying to leave. Number two is trying to leave. Wow. 
Right, well this is a good fish, so I don't want, really want to lose this. Don't think it's a boss fish, if I'm honest. But it could be, I mean, I'm not really making any ground on it at the second. Here we go, here we go. Just as I said that. Let's see, he's cruising back out. Come on, in you come. You know you want to. Come get your picture taken. I will catch up with your comments, guys. Two seconds. Don't forget to smash that like for me. Oh, oh. No, don't go around that corner. Come back this way. Come back this way. No. <laughs> Come back. <laughs> the other two rods are just on one. I've no idea where they are right now. This feels like a good fish, actually. This is fighting quite hard. I mean, I don't want to give it too much. Here we go. Right. That's rod one. Rod two. Let's try and get him off the... Yes, here we go. Right. Game on. I've no idea where rod three is. I can't even see it. Where's rod? Oh, there's rod three. He's cruising around the edge of the lake. That is awesome. Oh, get back this way. Come on. That's why I, I do prefer this swim because you've got sort of more room for fish to play to the right of you. And then you've got the left side of you as well where they can cruise right down and round the corner if they want. That's why I do like this sort of area. Like I said to you, I set it for five o'clock in the morning originally and I'd set it to light cloud. Come on. Yes, right. Rod three. Let's see where this one is. Oh dear. Where are you going? Get back here, you. We might lose this one, guys. That's what I'm thinking. Oh, no. He's in the water now. He's on the bank. Yeah, he's in the water. Yes. That's two we've recovered off the bank. Awesome. Plenty of stick. Says to me he's not very big. Oi, 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 don't do that. I'm not even reeling right now. Oh, there we go. Right. Whew. Didn't want to lose it, just in case. You never know. I will catch up with your comments, guys. Two seconds. The path is coming, small bug. The patch is coming, small bug, sorry. On St. John with imitation float. Yep. I should do some float fishing. I really should, but... I will. I definitely will do some float fishing for you guys. Maybe I'll do the, the float fish challenge to go catch a boss. £11.12. Not massive. Okay, so we all want to see what's on rod one. So I'll go to rod two first. Nice little carp. Guaranteed carp, because that's all that's in this lake is carp. Nice little common. £12.15. This one's got to be a mid-20s. It's got to be. Can we see it? Oh, it's looking big. <laughs> Is that the half lean again? No way. I'm not having that. <laughs> the half lean twice in one session. Guys, you've seen it on my videos in the past where I catch that sort of boss fish the same boss fish twice now you've seen it for yourselves this happens to me quite a lot i will say i've caught this half lin now four times so all good all good what i'm thinking is next lake that's two boss fish in theory from this lake so i'm thinking we either go to st john or we go to preza let's uh let's exit that St. John or Preza, guys? Where do you want to go? That fish loves you, big bug. I think you're right. On Preza, Del Monte Bravo. Okay, Preza, that's two. Going to watch the soccer. I'll leave a like. Be good. Thank you very much, unanimous decision. Much appreciated. We're going to Preza, Del Monte Bravo. Hope you enjoy the football, my friend. Preza. Don't go Preza till the patch goes St. John's. Do agree with you, but everybody wants it, so we're off to Preza. <coughs> I'm going to put it on light clouds, dynamic. <coughs> okay. 
Go see fishing, James Lovell. Yo, welcome to the stream, my friend. I hope you're keeping well, James. Thank you for tuning in. Much appreciated. I'm not much of a sea fisherman. I've got to be honest, my friend. I wouldn't even know where to start, in fact. If I'm honest. Prayers are all the way, says Dovetail Fisher. I know, but it will go in the mountains. This is very true. Right, we're going to fish... I'm going to start here um, and fish opposite the rock face. You'll see what I mean when we get there. Oh, it's a bit dark. I said five in the morning, didn't I? All oh, right, okay. Well, it's going to be a little bit dark, but it will soon brighten up, guys. Don't worry about that. Okay. Let's set this up. Right, we are going. Rod one. Uh, hang on a minute, hang on a minute. Got to make sure you stand in the right place or you can't put your rods down. I hope they patch that. That'd be really cool. Okay. Size 4 silk rig with a 20mm sink. Yep, that's where we're going with that. And I'm literally going to fish in front of me, guys. I'm not going to go to that other side just yet. I'm going to fish this at 15 yards. Or 14 we're in 11 foot of water, so not bad. Rod 2. We're going to go 20 mil pop-up on a size 6 chod. Chod rig, I hear you say. Are you crazy? Don't worry, guys. It'll work. It'll work. It's just a pop-up rig. All right. Same again. We're going to get that one to 15 yards. Very nice. And number three, we're going to fish, let's have a dumbbell on that one. Or should I just go all out tiger nut? Let's go all out tiger nut, sort it. KD rig. What? No, not yet. I ain't got me other rod out yet. Here we go. Don't think this will be anything massive, to be honest. First fish and all that. All right. Well, it's kind of uh, it's giving a good account of itself by all, all accounts. It's off. <clears throat> Sid is back. Hey, big bug, watch last stream. Amazing video. Thanks for the best content on Euro fishing. I'm glad you feel that way, my friend. Thank you so much for your support. I really do appreciate it. <clears throat> go on, big bug. Go on, big. Go on, big fish here. Yep. Yeah. I definitely will. Big dog Easto. Thank you for tuning in. Wade, unlucky small bug. I take it you lost something. Love that spot. Yeah, totally agree. I usually fish to the rocks on the other side, if I'm honest. Um, but let's just change it up a bit. Let's do something different. And we'll see how we get on. And uh, I might spot them rocks on the far side, which is what you can see. I call this the cliff swim. I call it fishing to the cliffs, which is just over there. Oh, this is fighting well, this fish. Come on. It's getting used to how the fish fight as well. They fight differently on different lakes. Have you noticed that as well? They definitely fight. Come on. Doing the eight yard dash. I agree with Sid on that. Best vids on you. Thank you very much, Martin. Much appreciated, my friend. I appreciate your support. Pray, boss fish. It's a carp. I definitely think it could be a carp. I'm not sure about a boss fish, though. It hasn't really sort of taken any distance off me. Just that. Oh, there we go. Right. It's definitely a carp by the looks of it. It's quite hard to tell. We need it to brighten up a little bit, don't we? There you go. Look at that. Nice linear. Is that half lin following me around? <laughs> <laughs> He's changed lakes. <laughs> Miracarp, twenty-four pound ten ounces. Great start. Got to be, got to be honest. Really pleased with that start. Not bad on the old tiger nuts as well. Let's get that back out there. Right, we want to go fifteen yards again. The distance of fifteen yards is so underrated on this game. I've had a lot of boss fish at that sort of distance. 
on all lakes, to be fair. Let's get this one out. Right, all three rods are now officially out, which is brilliant. I'm going to leave that one now. Right, I can read your comments for a second. It's a carp, yes. That fish is insane with you, baby. Yeah, it was going mental. It was like a as mad as a box of frogs. <laughs> that is awesome. Okay, let's see what happens then. So we've got to keep an eye out. Now, th that little creek around there, sort of where the lake, if you sort of follow the peak of my hat, where it goes around that way, there's always big cats around there, but I can never land them. They always go up the mountains and things. And it's just, in it's crazy going around there. I will give it a go. I mean, I, we will, s what is this fish doing? Come on. It's just staying on the bottom. Oh, here we go. Let's give up. The monster of the lake. Tench. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Awesome. Wow, this one's heading out of town. It's a bit lively, this one. Bream, I think. Is it zigzagging? Could be. Oh, easy. Another tench. Could be another tench. You're the best Euro fishing player. Thank you so much, small bug. Much appreciated. This one looks like it's got an oil stain on it. Or oh, it's in camouflage from them big cats, no doubt. £2.9 ounce tench. Thanks, showing up, tench. Go tell Megalodon we're waiting. Okay, let's cast this out. Then we need to try to get some spot on the area, I think. Try overfeed these small fish so they disappear. Let's get this one. Again, fishing quite close. Come on. I do like this lake. This lake's awesome. It's now starting to get daylight, which is even better for you guys. You'll be able to see it properly. Okay, let's get a spot on it. Right, so I'm going to cast over the area. And then wind back onto it. Awesome. Wind, wind, wind. Oh, bit too close. Yeah, I'm going to bring that back in. Do that again. Sort of bubbled in the water and come a bit too close. We'll be a bit more careful. I was rushing, to be honest. There we go. Getting line bites. Whee, there goes number three. Just ripped into life. Let's put the spot down. Okay, come on. Some fish activity over that other side there. Seeing bubbles and things going on. Whilst I'm fishing, I do actually sort of look around the lake, see what's happening elsewhere. This is fighting well. Come on. Another small carp, probably. Come on. It's fighting well. Giving a good account for itself. Not massive. Definitely not massive. Number one's just sort of cruising off. Nice run on number one. Come on, in you come. Let's give this one a little bit of stick. You're not massive. So. Definitely doesn't want to play though. Definitely don't want to come in. It's like, no, I'm camera shy. I'm not coming in. <laughs> awesome. Yeah, I'll, s I'll see you, big bug. Take care, big dog. Thank you very much for tuning in, my friend. Much appreciated. Yes, I caught two. Small plated. Oh, nice. I'm very jealous, my friend. I'm very jealous. <clears throat> I am definitely after small plated. Doesn't seem to want to uh, come play ball with me, small plated, for some reason. I'm hoping. I will go back on St. John. I will. You'll see a video soon where I'm catching it, without a doubt. Here we go. Right, that's in. Let's go to number one. He's heading over there. Come back. This feels alright. This feels like a good fish. Problem is, it's heading right down there and we don't want that. This feels like a really good fish. Come on. 
We should have got to it earlier though. Come on. Try, just trying to pull it back off that bank. Trying to give it as much stick as I can. Up in the line tension as much as I can. This feels really decent, this fish. Got to be careful. Right, he's in the middle of the lake. That is awesome. Yes. Come on. This felt like a really good fish at the start. I'm not so sure now, but definitely felt decent. Nice big tail. Sort of showing now. Oh, nice. Right, I'm going to net that straight away. I'm not sure what that is. That felt really good. Come on, Bob. Pray a big fish. Oh, wow. Look at that. That's a decent fish. That's got to be the best part of £30, surely. What's that? Is it? What one's it? Ah, oh, it's just a thirty-one pound three ounces. I said it felt good. I didn't. Oops, BB. Yeah, you know. Rod one might be a boss fish. What's your favourite bait, Big Bug? Uh, what in real life or on the game? On the game, probably the tiger nuts are really good. Um, but I also like the boilies, the activates. I had Fishy McFish f Fish Face, Fishy McFish Face on the 18, no, 15 mil high vis pop ups. That's a nice linear. Look at the colours of that. Real dark, real nice dark colours. £19.12. Yeah. Alright. I'm thinking I might go to that other side in a second and see what we can do. We'll have a couple more casts at the 15 yard mark. So you've got the wind in our face there. And then we're going to fish over to that, that rock face, I think. Let's bring that in a little bit. 17, 15, there we go. And rod one, same. Just get that to the 15. And then we're going to go to that. I might even change swim. I might even go across the other side there and fish. Along sort of alongside the rock face, if you know what I mean, that'll be really good. I might do that. Scott three twenty two. Please don't keep spamming your channel, my friend. It is rude. Okay. Uh, not big, doesn't feel big, I've got to be honest. This is where they normally sort of break into life. If they're anything big, they'll break into life and disappear on you. <laughs> right, come on. Get in the net. Come on. Get in, got another run on the other rod. I want to get the other rod now. Wouldn't mind seeing a big cat off of here, I've got to be honest. That'd be nice. Trouble is, like I said before, the big cats are real hard work to catch. Mind you, if you're sort of catching cats at 70, 80, 90 pounds, it's going to be so difficult to land that sort of fish. Here we go. Very nice. Fighting well. Bobbing around. Come on. No, 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 no. Oh, wow. I thought I'd give it too much line tension now. Don't want to lose this uh, tench. <laughs> Might be a bus tench. Not sure how many fish I actually need on this, this lake, boss fish wise. I think there's quite a few that I've still got to get. I've had quite a few. I wouldn't mind seeing cuts or something like that, to be fair. Awesome, big tent. That's not a boss tent, but it's a good one. What's that? Eight, eight pound? Eight pound ten, there you go. Look at that. Monster of a tent. Very nice. Right, let's get the next one in. 
What we got here? A little cup. Yep, little mirror cup. Very nice. Thank you very much. £14 one ounces. Not bad, not bad. That rod too hasn't done anything. Right, we're going to go long. Let's uh, see how close we can get to that rock face. If you leave a like, you catch all the same fish as Big Bug. Yeah, that'd be awesome, wouldn't it? I'd be going around every Euro fishing streamer and uh, there were some bubbles come up there. Oh, that's too late. Get back over there now. You've had your chance. We're moving. I'd be going around all the uh, YouTubers that do Euro fishing, hitting the like. <laughs> oh, landed it up there. Didn't quite mean that. Still quite deep there. You've got seven foot of water. That's decent. We'll put that down. And this one will move slightly more to the left. I should just go into that swim opposite and just fish it from there. I'm going to fall short on this one. See if we can go in slightly deeper water. No, eight foot. Okay, let's leave it there. Right, so we're all along that back edge. Now, that, that is particularly where I do love to fish. As you um, also see this bay here, guys, by the green sign. Again, on my... You look at my hat. The peak of my hat there. I had Big Mama out of here twice. Literally within... You know how you just seen me do it with Half Lin, where I had, the, I had him and then had him again? That happened with Big Mama from that bay. And that was on uh, Activate Boilies, I believe. Could have been Tiger Nuts, actually. Come on. Fighting well. Not gaining any real ground, but it's kind of holding its own. Come on. Can hear some. This is a small cat, this one. I've seen its tail. So, what I'm going to do with Rod 2, if Rod 2 doesn't become more active, I'm going to change that chod rig. Don't forget that's on a chod. So I'll change that chod rig to maybe a DF rig, size 4 DF rig or something like that. Come on, little cat. Looks more like a kitten than a cat, but we'll see. Let's have a look at him. Well, he's bigger than I thought. 20 pound? Almost white. Look at that. Snow cat. 21 pound, 2 ounces. Very nice. Thank you very much. Go tell Megalodon we want him. Right, let's get this one back out. Gone a little bit further along that rock face this time. That's it. Eight foot of water again, so we know we're in the right place. And number two must have had a bleep on it. I'll tell you what, I'm going to change that now, because that's kind of playing on my mind a little bit. Uh, KD rig, yeah. That's on a pop-up tiger, yeah, we'll take that, right. No, I wasn't ready. Okay, let's ditch that rod while that's... Come on. Couldn't get the uh, rod, rods up then. Right, here we go. Now, we've got big baits on, so was hoping to see bigger fish, but I'm not so sure at the moment. I mean, we're catching some real tiddlers here. I mean, really? Look at this. What is that, a roach? Oh, come on. Come on, come on, come on. Sub to Big Dog East though, please, guys. Don't spam your channel too much. I'd appreciate that. It is a little bit rude, my friends. Leave any shout outs to me. I'll shout you out. Okay. Done. Big dog eats though. Also, sub to sub guys don't really work. You're not, you know. £3.5 ounces. A little snotty. Right, let's uh, cast this one over there. Nice. 
Nice. Okay, just short of that. And rod three. Oh, wow. Rod one's torn off again. Probably something small again. Kind of broke into life quite quickly. Fighting. Okay, it's got bream written all over it. The way it's sort of darting around like that. Give him a little bit of stick. That was a big splash on that sort of rock just there to my left. Might put a rod over there. Come on, in you come. Tench. Put that one down, get the next rod. The Tench are loving them tiger nuts. Come on. Be nice if we can sort of tempt a boss fish out, wouldn't it? That would be much better. Scraff, all right, Nev, watching from Greece. Yo, Scraff, how we doing, my friend? Welcome to the uh, stream. I hope you're enjoying your holiday, my friend. I've been seeing a few of your pictures popping up on Facebook. I can say I am jealous. Come on. Get in the net. Ah, oh, look, it's just fighting to the death. Yes, here we go. Right. Boss fish! I wished. <laughs> Soz? Yeah, no problem, Dovetail Fisher. What's your favourite rig and rod line in Euro fishing? The 13... The, the way I'm set up now, to be honest, are my favourites. I do like the mono line, now. I've got to be honest. Uh, I'll tell you what we're going to do, guys. We're going to... Before I reel that number one in... I want to get this one on that rock face. I'm going to really fan the rods out a bit now. No, a bit harder than that. Oh, my days. Really? Right, I'm going to put this one over there. I'm going to put number two. I'm going to put in the middle here. Right, 15 yards out. Kind of work in the area a little bit here. Oh, really? I still haven't unhooked, unhooked number one yet. Wait. Sorry, number one. We'll unhook you in a minute. He's alright. He's just sitting in the net, sulking. <sighs> Another big fish. That is tiny. What is that? Is that a stickleback? Or a minnow? That's got to be the smallest fish I've ever caught. Don't tell me that's a pound. There's no way. One pound seven ounces, never. Absolutely not. Right, let's go to number one. We need to sort this one out. Oh, too late. What's tips to get bigger on YouTube? Oh, wow. Um, just keep doing what you're doing, my friend. Keep putting content out. I'm still trying to get bigger myself, um, but, and just build your own audience, you know, just do, try to do the best videos you can with what you've got. My biggest tips for YouTube are this, alright, I'll go through them quickly. I don't want to bore anyone in the chat though, but my biggest tips, if you're YouTubing, you should be doing this, the description. Tags, they're absolutely imperative. A good thumbnail, that's really, really, really important for pre-edited videos. I put thumbnails on every single video, pretty much, that I do. Um, you want them to be nice and attracting, so they catch the eye, you know. Try to use sort of bright colours if you can, that would be really cool. Or, um, and just keep, keep doing what you're doing. Try to do videos as regular as you can. Interact with your audience. I think that's a really important. And show people what they want to see. You know? Like I said, I'm still trying to master it myself. So, when I find out, I'll let you know. <laughs> right, that one now. 
Right, number one. There's a little bay over there. I'm thinking about fishing to it. But, let's uh, throw this down there. Okay, hopefully it will... That's where we were seeing fish sort of bosh. See the size of that cattail? Oh, wow, I hope number one goes off. I'm not even worried about number two. Let's hope number one goes off. That was a big cattail that come up on one then. Right, let's get three out. Right, the plans have changed somewhat now. That was a massive cattail. I, oh, I tell you what. Let's uh, get number two. Let's bring that in. I'm going to put two next to one. So let's go to the middle of that bay. Yeah, just where that fish was would be perfect. Can't see. Please don't sink. Yes, that do. Right. Okay. Loads of bubbles coming up there. Look at that. Look at that cattail. Oh, wow. Come on, number one. Yes. Be number one. Yes. Don't go around the corner, though. That's a no-no. Oh, that's a big cattail. Uh, we're going to be in trouble with this one, I think. Alright. This is a big fish. Please don't go on the bank. He's heading out of town, guys. He's heading out of town. No, no, no. Look at the yardage. 64, 65, 66. He's definitely heading down into that bay. And I can't stop him. I'm trying to up the real tension as much as I can. I want to snap him. Oh, wow. Just got to let him go. There's not, nothing I can do here. I'm on £25 braid here, guys. So, just got to let him go. I think we're going to end up losing him, but at least we know we've hooked him. It looked really pale as well, that, that tail. So, I'm thinking Megalodon. The way the tail came out, it was like a white in colour. I know Megalodon's very pale, sorry Rod 2, but we just can't do anything with you at the moment. Don't. That's it. I'm hoping he gets bored swimming down that end and wants to come back to us. That would be really nice. It'd be really nice if you could walk around the bank as well. That'd be really cool if you could do that got a feeling this is definitely a boss cat 100% but he's just cruising away from me he's at 139 yards 140 I've got no control over him at all I'm just trying to hold on to him as much as I can but I think we're gonna lose this one guys I'm, I don't want to be pessimistic but I think this is a dead cert loss oh yeah he hit the bank now he come out of out the, out the water there. That's why it went all slack and... Come on. Come on. I'm going to start applying a bit of pressure onto him. Come on. Get back down this way. We've just got to hold him and hope for the best. Can't read your comments at the moment, guys, so I do apologise. I probably will do a live stream tomorrow, um, but I definitely won't be on Friday. I'm at work Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, so I'll be back then on Tuesday. Will be the earliest time. Yeah, he's going around that corner. There's not a lot I can do about this. I've just got to wait now. I can't even see him. Just hope that he comes back to us. hope that he swims around in circles and decides to come back he's still in the water at the moment touch wood so we'll see what happens he's definitely on he's just around that corner at the moment 
So I'm just going to keep the tension going. He's slowly coming back towards us by the looks of it. The other one's come off, so at least all that bleeping stopped. Right, he is slowly coming back towards us here, guys. So as long as we're careful, we could be in for a... No, come back. Come back, please. Please come back. All right. Come on, back you come. He's coming back. Oh, nice big fish just jumped in front of us as well. I'm just going to hold him. I, I really don't want to give him too much stick. The, the line tension is on its absolute max. He's a big tail fish. You can see the, the tail popping up just then. Come on, don't go near that. He's going near the edge. He's definitely near the edge. Come on, he's 122 yards. We've gained some yardage on him. 121. We've just got to sort of hold him and hope. Come on. This is a big fish. Like I said, I am... I am expecting to lose it, I've got to be honest. Um, purely because of, you know, the way it is at the moment. But we'll see, we'll see what happens. 119, we're kind of working him now. Right, let's try and put him under a little bit of pressure. Let's see if we can pull him back towards us a bit. Trying to just gain as much line on him as I can. Let's go near that edge. Come back here, you. No. Come back. Wow. This is fighting hard, this fish. Number three, will you just hurry up and come off? The alarm's driving us all crazy. He's at 91 yards, so I am starting to gain a bit of yard, sort of yardage on him. I don't know where number three's going. Number three's going down to join this one. It's lucky your lines can't get tangled up. Can you imagine how annoyed you'd be now? Whoa. Maybe not as big as I thought. I was thinking earlier, Megalodon. Now I'm not so sure. Oh, that made me nervous. Come on. This is a big fish. I don't want to lose it now. 72 yards, guys. 71 Come on. 69, 68. He's going near the bank. No. No. Oh, wow, he's back out in the middle. 63 yards. Just trying to keep that tension high. Don't, don't go that way. Don't go that way. Right, okay. Right, he's coming around in front of us. Just, as long as we can keep him off that bank and give him as much stick as I can. It's at 57. Wow, this is a powerful fish. My hands are sweating and everything. Come on. I apologise I can't read the chat at the moment. It's not Megalodon, no. It probably isn't. I thought it was at first, but it's definitely one of the big cats. It might be Mowgli or... Is it Mowgli that's on here? I don't think I've had Mowgli yet, so... That might go down well. If I can get it in the net got a feeling we're still going to come unstuck with this fish to be honest but we shall see i'm going to give him a bit of stick now trying to 43 yards come on give me some luck here it looks like he's right over on that bank but looking at that he was just in front of us so that's encouraging 30 yards, 37. It's a big tail. Definitely ain't Megalodon. Megalodon runs out to about 250 metres. But the thing is, you can't go 250 metres in the direction that it went. Um, got a feeling this could be Mowgli or something like that. Let's hope we can get it in, eh? That would be really cool. Hands are sweating. Come on. Oh, you! I give it too much. Ah, oh, 
I was trying to give it some more, give it some more, and it snapped. Ah, <sighs> wow, what can I say, guys? My fault, totally. Totally give that too much stick. There you have it. Let's just get this real rod back out, and uh, hopefully we can catch something else. Gutted about that. That was definitely probably Mowgli or something like that, I would say. Let's leave that one now. Oh, it's moving. I will catch up on your comments. That was totally my fault as well. Normally, um, they run up the bank. But that was totally my fault, that one. I'd just give him too much stick. I should have just let him do his thing. I was nervous he'd try and get up the bank. And, uh, yeah, that's what happens when you give him too much. Right. My bad for that. I'm, I apologise, guys. I am gutted, I've got to say. Right, we're going to totally cover this area now, though. Just give that one into the middle. Oh, I can't believe I didn't get that in. I can't believe one mistake I made there. It just went bleep, and I thought oh, I'd be alright. Normally you get a couple of bleeps, and it just went bleep and come off. I was like, ah. Oh. So I've got to, I've got to accept responsibility for that. See you, big bug. Got to, got to go. Love the stream. Thank you very much, Dovetail Fisher. Really appreciate that, bugs. Did it have a Big black tail. No, it was more sort of like a brownie, like a light brownie sort of colour, if I'm honest. Doesn't matter now, because we couldn't get it in. But there you go, never mind. Some you win, some you lose. No doubt this will be a roach now, just to rub it in. <laughs> Come on. I've got to back that line off. We don't want no more snap-ups. It's another good fish. I've got to say, I can't I can't even tell where it is to be fair. 38, 39. It's in a little bit of a danger zone here, to be fair. Just get off the bank. Oh, oh, line tension's going all over the place. Number two's out of town. Look at that. Number two is gone. I can't believe it. It's not Puma. No, I well, don't think it was Puma. The tail looked a bit light to be Puma. But you never know. I mean, we, we'll never know now. Definitely had the colours of Mowgli or something like that. Right, number two. That one's in catch mode. Number two has set sail. Look at that. If this is a roach or a tench, honestly... Right, okay. So he's round the corner and he's on the bank. I'm kind of dragging him across land right now, look. He's on land. Yeah, I knew that was coming. Oh, wow. Not going well. Not going well. We're having a bad five minutes. Right, okay. Some you win, some you lose, guys. That's the way it goes. See if we can get this one in. Come on, in you come. This one's fighting quite hard as well. Might have hit a little hot spot or something here. Can't believe I give that fish too, just a little bit too much stick. And it just, uh, yeah, you saw what happened. Justin, yo, what's up, my friend? What's up, Big Bug? Greetings from Northern Germany. Wow, that is awesome, my friend. Welcome to the stream. I hope you're having a good day. An epic fight this was. Did they patch the spod rod bug? They haven't done any patches as yet, my friend. Um, we are waiting on patches. I know they're working on it, so 
Let's see what happens. When you do get that spod rod glitch, you just got to sort of cast right past your spot. And then sort of wind it back onto it. Didn't play Euro fishing for a few months. Whack them out. Tight lines. Thank you so much, Justin. I really do appreciate that, my friend. Nice to see you in the stream. Typical Philip. Sub, and I will sub back. I don't do sub, sub, my friend. I do apologise. Can you sub, bug? I will sub back. Like I said, typical Philip. I don't. Can you guys sub? Listen, we don't, um... Let me just sort this out. You got to stop asking for subs, my friend. I'd appreciate that. Right. I don't mind shouting people out. It's not an issue. It's, I really don't mind. But I don't like people coming into the channel just looking for subs. That's not what it's about. That is really rude, especially when, you know, you need to come in the stream, say hello. I will. I am happy to shout you out. Right, here we go. Right, number two. Let's get number two. Uh, I'll tell you what, let's check rod one. Better see what's on there, better way. Better have a look. Bug sub to me because he likes content. Good content. <laughs> Look at that's a leather. Wow, not not caught many of them. Leather carp, twenty two pound one. Nice. Should have made that a boss, really. They're so sort of rare the level leather carp now that I should have just made that a boss fish. I think. Right, we're going to go back on that same spot, just off the edge of them rocks there. Yep, just about there. And then rod two. We're going to put in the middle. I had Fishy McFish face from this middle area. On a 15 mil high vis pop up. Nice fish that lever. Yeah, totally agree my friend. That was awesome. Actually I'm back so I can't watch your awesome stream. Oh, so I can. Oh, awesome man. Another big cat tail on that one. That was really dark then. Hopefully this is the same. Big cat. I think we're on a big cat again, guys. Look at it. It's setting sail. It's taking off. I want him to come back this way, though. Oh, wow. Please don't go to that bank. Come on, this way. This way. Give me some luck here. Wow. Yeah, this is another big cat we're on here. I saw the tail pop up just as I... Um... This is definitely a big cat. Oh, yeah. He's, he's trying to get on the bank, though. This is not good. Don't want him on that bank. Gonna take it easy with him. Come on. The other two rods are going absolutely crazy. Come on, please get off that bank. He's really trying. He's only in a foot of water. You can see the tail sticking up. Let's... Got to get this one in. After the last one, this will give us a little bit of justice if this is a boss fish. Yeah, I think once he gets into that open water, he's going to stretch his legs down into that bottom bay again. That's kind of what I'm thinking. I wish you could kind of turn the alarms off on them other two rods. That would be really good. No. I'm just going to take it easy. Wow. We're on. This is a definite boss. Look at the size of the tail popping up. He's not stretched his legs yet. If he gets in that open water and follows that bank round, we're going to be in a bit of trouble. He's going to sort of head for that bottom bay down there. Come on. Give me some luck, baby. Give me some luck. Don't want to give him too much stick. Right, let's give him a little bit more. Just going to back him off. 
I like to keep my line tension quite tight, but I've got to be careful here because right, one of them's come off as a result. He's, he's just hovering around that area. He's not actually... Oh, here we go. This is where he stretches his legs now, down in the open water. Wow, big fish splashing next to me as well. Yeah, here he goes, look. He's stretching his legs. He's just making a run for it. Just going to have to let him go. Just hold on tight. Not a lot I can do here, I'm afraid. Wow, second big cat on. The pressure is on, guys. After the last one, the pressure is on. I dropped a like for you, man. Thank you. Ah, oh, Bamtastic. Yo, welcome, my friend. Everyone go check out Bamtastic's channel. Does a lot of Black Ops 3. And um, it's got a hunting simulator on there. Done a bit of fishing on there. Go check, out, go check his channel out, guys. Really good channel. One that I particularly enjoy sort of watching. Lurking around as it was. Another big fish on here. After the last one that we lost, it'd be really nice if we can get this one. He's at 95 yards. He's kind of heading out of town. Let's give him a little bit of stick. See if we can draw him back. No, he's going. Yeah, he's coming back. He's coming back. Come on. 88 yards. Come on, 89, no, he's still taking line. Oh, wow. We're running out of lake here, guys. We're definitely running out of lake. He's going to hit the land any second. Come on. Hey, he's stuck at 89 yards at the moment. We're on a bit of a stalemate. He's kind of sat out. There he is. Oh, he's not as far down as I thought, actually. Could afford to give him a little bit more stick. No, nope. don't you bleep. That happened before, remember? Bleep, snap. Uh. Right, that other rod's finally come off, thank God. So all that bleeping stopped. But he's heading around the corner, we don't want that. We don't want him around that corner. That's, that's the corner where they like to climb mountains. We definitely don't want him around now. Just holding on to it. I'm just going to back off the pressure just a little bit. He's a good fish. I wish I could just walk around that corner. Oh, we don't want him around now. Come on. Give us a break. Get back around here, you. 69. No. Got to back him off. He's, he's going around that corner, guys. I think we're going to lose him. I honestly think we're going to lose him. I'm on 25 pound braid. 13 foot rods. I've got big reels on. I can't possibly do any more than I'm doing. Got to not get frustrated with it. Big dark tail. Greetings from Holland. Scarebo. Yo. Welcome my friend. Thank you for tuning in. Much appreciated. BK4444 says hello. Welcome to the stream, my friend. Don't forget to smash that like, guys. That would be really appreciated. This fish is going on land by the looks of it. And we can't stop him. He's still in, he's in deep water at the moment. He's in 20 foot of water, but he's at 6 foot. So he's kind of middle of the lake. Oh, wow, come on. I was going to do the old reverse psychology thing. Pull the other way and hope he'll head the other way. But I don't really want to take the chance. I've just got to sit it out. Sit and hope. Just watch that. Oh, he's on land. He's on land. Oh. Wow. Really? Please don't do that, Mr. Fish. That is not good. Get round here. Alright, let's start cranking the pressure on a little bit. Surely he's tiring now. Come on. He's just hovering around that corner. He's desperate to get around that corner. Just watching the line tension. Just hoping. Just hoping. Come on. 
The viewers at home want to see you. <laughs> so do I. <laughs> now get round this corner. Come on. He's in three foot, two foot, one foot. He's going. He's heading for the bank. He's really trying. He's trying to get down that, that sort of channel down there. I do want to give him a little bit of stick, but not too much. I'm pushing my luck now. I'm really pushing my luck. Oh, this is this is frustrating. Come on. No. Don't come off. He's on the bank. He's on the bank. This is it, guys. This is where he comes off. That's it. He was on the bank. What can I say? <laughs> Let me have a drop of my coffee here. Yeah. My coffee's gone stone cold. Two big cats we've lost now. But, that is the way the cookie crumbles, I'm afraid. Let's try again. Wipe our mouths and try again. Just unlucky, that's all it is. There's not a lot you can do about that. Alright. Okay. One. Let's get the second rod. Them two rods were screaming off for ages, weren't they? That's just unlucky. What not mind a fish that we can actually catch. Sort of catch her. We haven't seen a fish on the bank for a while now. But it just goes to show, guys. Sometimes, you you know, you can't win them all. We've lost two big cats. And we're on another good fish here, by the feels of it. It's not a cat. 27, 28. Wow, this is taking some line as well. Right, let's try put him under a little bit. Look at this. Come on, get back here. All oh, right, he's give up. He's got a mid mid twenty carp or twenty pound carp written all over it. Come on, in you come. We want to at least see one fish on the bank. After losing them couple, what's that? A small cat? Yeah, it looks like a small cat. Doesn't really make up for what we lost, but we'll take it. It's no worries. Like I say, can't can't win it all the time. Come on, come on, come on. Get in the net. These fish are fighting hard tonight. They're really determined. Not right. Thank you. All right, let's get rod two while well, that's in catch mode. Go straight onto rod two. Awesome. What's that? Another little cat? Yeah, another little cat. The cats are really having it down there in that bay. Tempted to move swims, to be honest. Sort of nearer to that that area. Right, let me refresh my chat, guys, because uh, it says unable to connect to chat, so I do apologise. Oh, blimey, look. I've lost. I've missed loads of your comments. I didn't realise my chat had frozen. Sorry, guys. Unlucky, mate. No way. You don't deserve that. That's the way it goes, my friend. <clears throat> CC and Brotastic says, Hi, and welcome to the stream, my friends. Two times. You really don't deserve that big bug. Connor Atkins, thank you, my friend. It's the way it goes. It's, you know, that's fishing, I'm afraid. We'll, uh, we'll wipe our mouths and we'll get over it and we'll try catch something. At least one boss fish off here, I reckon, don't you? Right, let's get that one in the net. It's Jensen. Ah, hi Jensen. How are you, my friend? It says again, unable to connect to chat. Please try later. What is going down here? Nice white cat. £21, 2 ounces, doesn't make up for the one we lost. I'm going to keep saying it as well. Or the two that we lost. Right, let's get this one in so we can sort these rods out. 
Hi Big Bug, love your content, wasn't here last night so good luck and hope you catch well yesterday. Thank you Alex, much appreciated. You're a star. £26.11 ounce cap, very nice. Right, let's sort these rods out. What rods is this? this one or two? This is one. So I'm going to put it back on that edge. Because it's done well for us that edge. Seems like a little sort of area that the cats like to go to, being that we've sort of lost two from there. Right, rod two. I'm going to put rod two right on top of rod one. Right next to it, I do. Thank you. And we're going to go rod three. Don't forget to smash that like, guys. I'd really appreciate that. That really does help us out. Oh, uh, we're going to have to ditch this cast. Go straight to it. Well, that's casting out. It's landed in front of me. <laughs> right. Could be another little cat, I reckon. It feels like another little cat, for sure. I'm having the same problem. Hi, bug. Loving the cover. Yeah, it's, it's the way it goes, Faithful, to be honest. Just, you know, some you win, some you lose. Other days you'll come on in, you'll, you'll smash it and land them cats. And some days you come on and they just run you ragged. See, if that cat would have took off down the other end, it might have been better. Would have had more room to run. But I don't know if you've noticed, the fish never tire when they're at distance. They sort of only tire once they're under the rod tip. So maybe that's something that's coming in the patch, I'm not sure. Hopefully they catch it soon. That would be really cool. But, like I said before, if you're hooking sort of 80, 90, 100 pound catfish, in real life you're not always going to land them. Um, I do accept that. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. But sometimes, you know, it would be nice to sort of get the better of them. Nice little common. We're going to throw them straight back and get them to the other rods. Rod 2. Got freeze having a little cruise around the area. Oh, seriously. Rod three. That was tiny, that one on rod two. I have no idea what that was, but it was tiny. I read it was a little roach or something. Little, this has got bream written all over it. We might have missed our window of opportunity, guys, to have them big cats out. What's that? A little tent? Yeah, I've got a thing. Might have a little, couple of little tents there. Let me refresh the chat. I don't know why it's freezing like this, to be honest. Let's have a look. Chat is broken for me. Yeah, it's breaking for me as well, my friend. Not quite sure what that's about. Same. Just go up to the top left-hand corner. You've got like a half circle with an arrow. Press that and it will refresh the chat. Not quite sure what's going on with the chat, but it's definitely not my end, my friends. It's um something that's happening on YouTube for everyone, I would say. Right, rod three. Oh, have I got a fish on rod two? I have, haven't I? Better bring that in, I suppose. This monster roach or whatever it is. Probably a monster roach. Let's have a look. <laughs> <laughs> look at that so we go from losing two boss fish like we did to a one pound four ounce roach really come on all right let me try sort this chat out what's going on here that's a big one monster <laughs> you know didn't you Right, hopefully chat all keeps coming up unable to connect to chat. Please try again later. I'm not quite sure what's going on here. Let me um, just come off the stream quickly. And then I'll go back to it. Let me go back to the stream now. I'm just quickly, while I'm doing that, let me cast these rods out. Right, rod, let's get on rod one. We want that one on that, that little corner again. Just there. 
bit that just sticks out is where we want it. Right, let's go back to the live stream. And back onto the chat. That's perfect. Where it is there is absolutely perfect. No, it's dropping off. It's on the move. Where, where are you going? Yo, dude, where are you going? Nine foot. That really shelves off there. We have to recast that. Now it wants to play up. Right, come on. There's like a little sort of shelf. We need to land it on top of the shelf. Right there. Stay there, please. Don't move. Let's get this one out to the middle. That's in 11 feet of water. That'll do nicely. And let's put number three next to that one as well. Let's go to the watch room. we get inundated with small fish we might have to move spots I think that's what could be happening yeah I think we should change spots guys that's what I'm thinking we're getting a lot of small fish now we'll land these couple of fish and I think we'll oh, all right we'll land this fish hopefully look I'm not even pressing the reel when it's maxing out what are you doing Oh wow, this fish does not want to come in. <laughs> <laughs> Nearly snapped me up. Carp says, what's up, big bug, yo? Biggest fish of the season. Look at that. Is that a boss roach? Surely not. Clarence, wow. So after we lost two big cats, we finally got a boss fish. It's Clarence. Not sure if I've had Clarence before or not, actually, but... A welcome addition, three pound two ounce roach. I thought it was fighting quite hard. I couldn't understand why. And just as I said, we're going to move. And I think now we're on that note, we're going to move swims. That's what I'm thinking. I think that could be the way forward. Big bug cast all three rods on target nuts, twenty mil up the channel in front of you. I had cuts, megalodon, cheetah, puma, big mama, etc. Gotta go, Bug. Hope to see you on stream tomorrow. Love this one. See ya. Thank you very much, Dovetail Fisher. That is really cool. We're having a few problems with the chat here, guys. I'm not sure exactly what's going on. Um, I am going to change swims. I'm thinking about moving to that swim over there, if I'm honest. That one over there. Maybe cast down that way. What do we think? Another monster, that monster! Yeah, you know. Move to the swim to the left. Yeah, okay. We'll do that then. Right, so... You want me to move that way? Uh, no, sorry, that way. Ugh. Left, right, and all that. Okay, let's go this way. Well, this is where we were sort of hooking the fish. Just off this point here. Wasn't it? So you're saying, the problem with this swim here is you can't actually see your markers. Which is really frustrating. But, I'll show you what I mean. I'll peg up in it. Your markers sort of disappear. Right, we're going to put one literally down here. Oh, live and let live. Got to live dangerously, right? Let's go for it. That's in... Wow, that's really deep there. 18 foot of water. I'm going to leave that one now. We're going to have number two. We're going to put... Just there. I'm hoping this will ride up on the bank and I can wind down into the water. Oh, no, that'll do. That's perfect. What depth we got there? 15 feet. That's pretty deep there. And number three, we're going to put just in that little bay area there. I'll tell you what, just on that edge. I think this is going to cast right over. Yep, that's it. Oh, perfect, right. 
just there. All right. Let's see what happens. Now I'm fishing real danger, danger fishing here. This is what I call this. Another monster. Why is the chat freezing like that? Don't forget, hit that refresh button, guys, in the top left-hand corner. Hopefully that will free the chat up a little bit. Look, I've missed so many of your comments. Why is the chat doing this to me? Uh, let's have a look what you've put. World of Rods are stagnant. All around 80 yards. Loving the stream. Thank you very much, Carl. Carl Carl says, no, no. You see that sign? That swim. You said left. I went left. Well, that sign over there. I don't want to go over there. Not unless I'm stalking. I had Smurfy out of here and Scar. Nice. Will Bar Bartlett says, Hi. Yo, Will. How you doing, my friend? Thank you for tuning in. Much appreciated. Don't forget to smash that like for me, my friend. That would be really cool. Let's see if we can uh, attempt to fish out of this. This area here. We've lost two real big cats tonight, which has been a shame, but that's the way the cookie crumbles. It's crumbled badly for us tonight, but we just had Clarence. This feels like a decent fish. Can't quite tell where it is, to be honest. This is on PS4, guys, so bear that in mind. PS4 has got a few little problems around it at the moment regarding this game, but we all know about that. Uh, they are working hard to patch it up and sort it out for us, so that would be really cool when they do. Look, the marker's just disappeared. I've no idea where this fish is right now. Here we are. It's just down here. Little cat. Come on. Out you come. Come on. Get round here. You're just a kitten. Get round here. You're not even a real cat, you're a kitten. <laughs> Look, he's cruising. So I'm out of here. You're not having my picture. Move. Come on, in you come. Let's be having you. Come on. I'm having some problems with this chat tonight. I don't know why it's, uh, it's freezing every time. Like that. Monster kit and that. <laughs> you know that, didn't you? £28.6 ounces. Not a bad start. Let's uh, chuck this back down now. A little bit further this time. Let's get a bit braver. <clears throat> really annoying me, this chat at the moment. It's a YouTube thing. I'm going to leave it right there. Let me... Uh... I'll constantly refresh the chat. I'm not sure why it's doing this. Don't do this to me, YouTube. Question for everyone. What do you catch in real life? I go for the carp. Alex, what's your gamer tag? Says Kyle. Ah, Luke. I think that is. Lovely show, mate. Already smashed that like button. Thank you so much, my friend. That is really cool. Zumba, is that? Z Zumba says hello. Welcome, my friend. I apologise. I'm having problems with the chat, guys. It keeps freezing and not quite sure what's occurring at the moment. We will sort it out, though. I have no idea where this rod is. I can't see the markers. The markers have disappeared. This is why I don't really like this swim very much. Because I can't see where the markers are. Oh, there's one. Um, let's get that number two. Really? Oh, right, number one rod in the dike, or the ditch, or the... I call it Cat Alley, actually. When I'm on here with friends. Oh, no. Wow. Trying to snap me up, this one. Really? Come on, get in the net. What is going on with this chat? Honestly, tonight, 
chat bar just keeps freezing out. I'm not quite sure what's going on with that. Question for everyone. Uh, yep, seen that. Come on, YouTube. Sort it out. The size of that roach. That was tiny. You're telling me that roach are going to hang around in Cat Alley? No, I'm not having that. Right, let's throw that down now. YouTube having problems yet? Yeah, definitely, my friend. Carl, I'm on Xbox. What would you like? They have match. I don't have Xbox at the mo. Been on bank too much. Rampant leader 94. What Xbox joke? Oh, right, okay. Yeah, YouTube's having a few issues at the moment, my friends. That's why I can't see a lot of your comments. Right, what's going on with this number two? Shall we see if we can... Uh, let's just plonk it out in front of us, I'm thinking. The swim is annoying for this. Look. Don't know. I'm not going to be sitting in this swim for long, if I'm honest. In fact, I'm going to move. Uh, let's move. Now. Right, let's find a signpost and let's move. I think there's one over there, yeah. Should have kept a rod in me hand because there's always big cats down here. It's a guarantee that you get big cats down here. Kyle, big bug, you got Facebook. Yep, if you go to my the front of my channel, where the channel banner is, you'll see a link to my Facebook account. Why haven't I got a rod in me hand? That is quite frustrating. Right, let's go... Let's go into the dead end, I think. I do like this swim. Alright, let's get some rods out. Let's go one over there. You got Facebook? Gotta go, Big Bug. Love watching the stream. Hope to watch again tomorrow. Thank you, Connor. You're an absolute star. Thank you for your support, my friend. That is really cool. It's just uh, like that. Awesome. Get that second rod. I'm thinking put one maybe there and then one over here. It's kind of my method of thinking. I'm not sure what you guys think. I usually fish the middle, but it's a bit boring. Right, let's... Um, yeah, that's exactly where I was thinking, right there. And the third rod, I'm thinking sort of this corner. It's going to go up on the bank and we'll wind it down. Don't forget, I'm using 13 foot rods, so doing a short cast is quite. Oh, there you go. Happy days. Could be quite difficult at times. Look how deep that is. Look. 20 foot of water. Seriously? That is deep, man. Let's see what happens down here. Do you have Xbox One version of Euro Fishing? No, I don't. Unfortunately. Someone's put yes. I have given you a shout out, Big Bug, in one of my streams, mate. Just to say thank you for the shout out you gave me. Thank you very much, Scott. Much appreciated. That is really cool. So refresh the chat. No problem. This. What is going on with YouTube tonight? YouTube, sort your crap out, please. No problem. This. This. It. The swim I use. Oh, this is the swim you use. Right, okay. That is awesome. Not quite sure why we're having so many problems with the chat at the moment. It just keeps freezing and things. Mind you, I am going to end the stream soon. Soonish. We'll come back to Monte Bravo maybe tomorrow for some revenge. I'll call it Bugs Revenge. Look at this fish. This fish is going bananas. Really? Come on. This is a brain. 
It's got bream written all over it. You can tell. Look at the way it's having a mad one. It's as mad as a box of frogs. <laughs> Yay, get in the net. There you go. Little beach ball football type shaped bream. Four pounds two ounces. Thank you very much. Right, guys. I think we're going to call it a night there on this stream. Uh, it's getting late. I want to have a coffee. I've got to go to the toilet. I've got to do all those type of things. I will be back on tomorrow at 7 o'clock. Um, so it's Wednesday today. Thursday tomorrow. Yep. So 7 o'clock tomorrow. I will be back on. Don't forget there will be no stream Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday. Because I'm at work. And then I should be back on the Tuesday. So tomorrow. 7 o'clock-ish. Between 7 and half past 7. See how we get on. And I uh, hope to catch you all there. Don't forget to smash that like if you're new around here. Smash that subscribe. I do apologise about the uh, chat freezing up. I'm not quite sure why that's doing that. I think that's a YouTube thing. Um, don't forget we will hopefully be doing some giveaways f to do with Dovetail Euro Fishing. Uh, hopefully might be able to get some game codes or some t-shirts or something sorted out. And uh, we can sort that out. Thank you very much guys. Look after yourselves. Take care. Peace.